Okay, folks, let's calculate reservoir temperature. Let's look at a question. You are drilling a well in an area where the temperature gradient per 100 feet of depth is 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit. What temperature would you expect to find at 12,000 feet of depth? Well, let's solve that problem. Reservoir temperature equals depth, true vertical depth, divide it by 100 times 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit plus 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, let's just look at this, this equation first to understand it. Reservoir temperature, we're looking at depth, and depth is always true vertical depth. How deep is it? If we're drilling in an angle, we may have 11,000 feet of pipe in the hole, but we may only be 10,500 feet deep. So we're looking at depth from top to bottom. We divide it by 100, and the reason we do that is that we're given a temperature gradient based upon 100 feet. In this problem, it says for every 100 feet we go da drill down, the temperature increases by 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit. So I want to find out how many 100-foot sections we have. We do that by dividing the depth, true vertical depth, by 100. And then we multiply that by 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, what some people tend to leave off of the equation is what can cost you a lot of points. Don't forget, if we go outside today and stick a thermometer in the ground, it is not going to read zero. In the oil industry, in the U.S. oil industry, we use 60 degrees Fahrenheit as a standard. So unless you're told otherwise, 60 degrees is what you will use. So we can't forget there is an ambient temperature. Let's go ahead and solve this problem. So reservoir temperature would equal 12,000, which is the true vertical depth of our well, divided by 100 times 1 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit plus 60 degrees Fahrenheit. So our answer would be 120 there's 120 100-foot sections in our well, so we multiply that by 1.2 degrees Fahrenheit, and then we add 60 degrees Fahrenheit uh, ambient temperature. So, reservoir temperature equals 144 degrees Fahrenheit plus ambient temperature, 60 degrees Fahrenheit. And our answer is 204 degrees Fahrenheit. That is the temperature we can expect in this well at 12,000 feet of depth.